Hey, 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 what's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. Uh, happy Wednesday. For those of you new to my channel, my name is Elaine. I'm the owner of what? LBE. Sorry, it's a, it's a little blocked up there, but it's okay. You guys get it. Uh, <laughs> uh, first off, before I even start this video, let me give a, a huge shout out to my girl, Baskets and More. My, uh, Baskets and More. Baskets and More. Um, her name is Joy, and she is the real deal, holy field, when it comes to these Bath and Body Works concepts. And actually, a lot of concepts, period, because she does Dollar Tree concepts, Bath and Body Works, um, uh, Victoria's Secret. I mean, like, she on point. Um, and I like her concepts because she utilizes a lot of simple concepts um, that's easy to grasp on and take advantage of. And y'all see, your girl is taking advantage of them, okay? Um, I do not... I want to use these larger containers, but I do not want to sit here and put 12 million things in them, okay? Um, so, there are going to be some big luxury baskets I'm going to do with, um, you know, quite a few items or whatever, but um, they won't have Bath & Body Works in them because when you add multiple and multiple and multiple and multiple things to add Bath & Body Works items, it really raises that price. Um, and especially, like, if I put, me personally, if I put Bath & Body Works with, like, a handbag, and some other stuff i want like four five hundred dollars for it i'm just gonna be honest so <laughs> we're not even gonna go there okay um i think the highest basket i have so far is about 275 um i may take some up to about 350 i don't know we'll see uh but i think 275 is probably gonna be the highest i'm gonna go unless somebody like specifically requests uh something a little bit more expensive but 275 i think is the highest i'm gonna go on um some baskets i think don't quote me on that <laughs> but uh anyway i came over here to show y'all this easy concept that i love joy for first and foremost she had me going out to dollar tree because your girl didn't get none of these after christmas and i should have which are the garment boxes um but luckily dollar tree sells them thank you jesus um and it's a two-pack for a dollar 25 so you get two boxes for $1.25, which is really not bad. I would have preferred to only pay like 20 cents for like a pack of six or eight or 10. Like they sell them at, you know, after Christmas. But, you know, you win some, you lose some. But guess what? You live to see another day. Okay. Uh, so anyway, um, and it also makes it so much easier to wrap these robes around it. So as y'all can see, look how much space it takes up inside the robe which allows you to take up quite a bit of space inside the basket now the, the containers i'm using are these totes from um dollar tree for those y'all who don't know i just showed you a haul that i did where i got the summer colors which were the red the royal blue uh and the turquoise and then i have these which are the softer colors that usually come around come out around fall um which is this like pastel looking pink and then like this um I don't really know how to explain the color of this greenish bluish turquoise looking color but it's a soft soft uh, color and it went very well with this gift basket so as you can see that's the color I use for the container um, and then keeping it simple like Joy does I just added in a pair of these fuzzy socks that I got in a two pack um, this is the other pair it comes with solid uh, pink and then that little turquoise uh, mint green looking color whatever color that is y'all I can't I can't keep up. I'm calling it turquoise, okay? Um, it matches right well with the Hello Beautiful um, Bath and Body Works set. Again, um, I don't know if y'all saw, like, in my short, I only got the lotion and the sprays. I didn't do the body washes and all that good stuff. Um, and we don't have one of those outlets here. They closed it down years ago. So the closest outlet I have is the one in Georgia, I believe, which is about three hours away. And if I had time to take a road trip... <laughs> your girl will be there um but i don't have time to take the road trip so i'm gonna have to just wing it um but anyway so i took those that that was these are my inspiration i grabbed the robe with the hearts and the hood that i got from family i mean from dollar general that doesn't have the headband and i paired it with some socks um because i wanted to keep the color scheme flowing then i pulled out my um these candles Y'all know, for those y'all who did the clearance event, one of the clearance events, they had these candles on clearance. Now, mine was like a dollar and 37 cents a piece, I believe, for two. I know some people had to pay like two dollars, depending on where they were at and what store they went to. Um, but I separated the candles and I'm putting one in each basket. Um, this is the breeze one, the blue one. 
but what I did was just put the candle in there and then I added the shred now I'm not adding the matches because I have a small selection of those matches left that I'm gonna use in some other concepts so I just was like you know what now you just get the candle <laughs> it is what it is unfortunately um, and then so I wrapped the candle put the candle in the box and then um, of course I filled it again with the basket filler so the candle don't do a whole lot of movement and then I just wrapped it in some pink to match oh some ribbon to match the color scheme of the whole gift now this has a lot of soft pink in it or light pink so I went with the dark to make it pop more um, or the you know the bright the um, hot pink color to make it pop more and make that come out of the um, Bath and Body Works set uh, together as well. Now I did and I'm still putting on the little stickers uh, I mean the little uh, ribbons that you get for free at Bath and Body Works. I took all of them. Well I didn't take all of them but I took enough to cover my <laughs> my uh, items my merchandise um and i'm still putting them on there because y'all i have my husband is gonna be out to help me my mom's gonna be helping me and probably my stepson and my nephew are all gonna be helping me probably this uh this mother's day and they don't really know nothing about bath and body works so i need them to make sure they justify now these gonna have prices on them but at the same time i want to make sure don't nobody like try to switch the price and all that and I need to make sure they identify them as Bath and Body Works products because they're going to be sold at a different price than the Body Ecology and, and any other probably gift that I create. Um, so I want to make sure that we can identify those particular items. So I feel like the blue still, it works in the favor. It don't really take away from the aesthetics of the whole gift itself. So I'm going to keep putting them ribbons on there so that I can make sure that everybody know what type of products these are. Um, and then on the side here, um, I just added in a turquoise and a pink rose. Y'all know these roses that I get from that I got from uh, Amazon. A lot of people getting theirs from Timu. I know Lady Di gets hers from Timu, um, but I had so many, and I think um, KOK Party Favors gets hers from Timu as well. Um, but I still have several from Amazon because I place I get mine in like a 60 pack or whatever it is. Y'all know I don't buy nothing in small quantities. <laughs> So anyway, I still have quite a few left that I can tweak into some baskets and stuff. So I'm going to use up what I have and then I'm going to place an order for a whole nother uh, collection of them. Um, when you come around here, um, how mine is standing up, I know um, for those of y'all who watch Joy, she ties her down with a piece of tape going from the front to the back. How mine is set up, um, I took, of course, my all-time favorite fish line. And because the way I tied the um, robe off, I always use the belt that comes with the robe. Um, and I just tied it around. That's what you see right here in the front. And it also it, um, helps fill in some space um, by having the belt like dangle down um, in front. And then you can kind of like maneuver your products around that to keep them secure as well. Um, so anyway, I took the... Um, fish line and I just took a piece and I looped it up under the belt and then I tied it off to the loop of the back this up there's because you know these these baskets have like uh, holes on each side so I just tied off from the belt of the robe to the hole on the basket on both sides and you know kind of pulled it nice and tight where it stands up straight um, and then if you come onto the back of course I add in another rose there and then I have these massagers I can grab another one out of this Pop Shelf bag I got over here. I have these massages that I got from Pop Shelf um, for $1.50. They're made by Brookstone, which is a good company. Um, and I just put one in there and I just put the, the top part, this little flat part, up under the belt of the rope. And that just got it in there nice and secure. I don't have to tape it down. I don't have to do nothing. Um, and then I tucked in one of the slippers, uh, one of the slides, I tucked it inside of the belt um and have it sitting like with its back against the uh robe and then i took the other slide and i leaned it you know sideways took some fish line because i'm keeping this little clear string on here that has the the tag with the size of the slippers i'm keeping that on that attached to that one uh one slipper and then what i did was i took some fish line and i tied it around this slipper and attached it to um this little string with the other one so it stays up as well so um that's what i did with this gift set again it keeps it simple um it fills it in where you don't have to add 12 million items and it doesn't look like you need anything extra um and i like how the colors are flowing they popping baby they popping um and so <laughs> 
the only ribbon I could think to use was some more of the bright pink because again I want that to pop out and make this whole gift stand out and bring out the colors inside of the products the Bath and Body Works products and then I have some ribbon that's pretty much the same color as this container um, so this is the bow that I'm going to use um, to finish this off and I think it goes really really well with this whole gift set um, and I'm just going to use the, the ribbon that I have because I have quite a bit and we're going to keep on rocking okay um, so that is that gift set um, and then I want to show you guys um, the blue one that I put together I don't know if you guys saw my short video but um, let me slide some of this out of the way and put my other candle up there and show you the blue one that I put together with the gingham which is this one right here um, I use blue and white uh, ribbon and this white is actually trimmed in silver and I got this from a yard sale y'all I got three rolls of this from a yard sale for like a dollar and fifty cents a roll and she sold me this big old roll which is a hundred yards it's one and a half inches and I have three of these <laughs> So I was like, baby, it's time to put that ribbon to use because this has been sitting over there for, for, for some time now. Um, so anyway, I used the gray robe with this concept. Um, and then again, I used the gingham blue and white uh, set. Added in one of the Midnight Breeze blue candles and added the um, some of the satin blue ribbon around that to tie that off and color coordinate that. that. And then I used the headband that comes with the robe as a filler. Added in two roses. I got some silver and some white roses. Added those in. And actually, she they filled in the whole front of this basket. Um, and this is the same size tub as the uh, other one I just showed you. And then I just added in the gray slippers and a massager in the back that I got from the massager I got from Ross. Um, and the slippers came from Dollar Tree. So. That's how that came together, and I'm really loving how these, these gift baskets are coming together. Um, and I'm going to make, I have three sets of that gingham blue. I'm going to make three, two more of these, exact same way, because uh, we have, first off, we have school colors here that are blue, white, and gray. So I never know if it's going to be a graduation gift or it's going to be a Mother's Day gift to a mother that loves the color blue. So you just never can be too sure. So I'm going to make sure I have several concepts pretty much the same because it's, I mean, to me, these just draw attention. And as you can see, I didn't put much products in here. The main products I put in here was the Bath and Body Works. I threw, I added in a candle and then I added a massager and some slippers and then you got the robe. So uh, what is that? One, two, three, four, five, six seven <laughs> but makes eight with the bucket okay so as y'all see this is where i'm going with this whole situation um so i'm keeping them simple but yet making them look really really nice and full and a joy again it is a joy to know you and a pleasure to have you on the youtube world sharing your gifts because you are rubbing off on your girl okay thank y'all so much for watching don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and we'll see y'all next video peace